Welcome to St. Martin's on the Isles of Scilly for my little staycation and I have arrived during what seems to be just spring wildflower season and this view I'm going to show you in a second is just insane. I cannot believe it. Wait until you see. Look at all those daffodils and that ocean. Literally died and gone to heaven. Hey guys, so it's my first night on St. Martin's and I am going to show you the best sunset view. Let me show you this view how incredible is that so there's literally no one on the beach not a single soul on the entire beach how incredible is this this could be anywhere abroad let me put my sunglasses on yeah you totally could be on a tropical island somewhere how insane is this <laughs> I've come down to this sunset spot in Hire Town and the sunset this evening has been spot on. Let me just show you the remainder of it. really early this morning so I decided to come and watch the sunrise this is where I am headed you can't really see because of the focus but when I get there I'll show you it's a bit chilly but oh, so peaceful so I made it to a sunrise at this point and there's no one around, it's just me and look at this bay. Let's see if we can. Wow. Look at that view and that golden colour. Now let me show you what's behind. to St. Martin's, 100% you're going to want to hire um, some form of water sports kayak or a sup and come out and it's going to low tide to the beach just here because you get the sandbars, the views, the entire bay and it honestly just feels like you're in a tropical island that isn't in England. This is incredible. Why I love the Arsene Silly so much. Today I am still on St. Martin's and I've decided I'm going to do a beach day because the weather is just incredible and it's kind of going down to low tide so perfect, perfect situation.
So this is Great Bay and Little Bay on St. Martin's and wow, the weather has been amazing today and look at that turquoise water. There's so much like yellow gorse on the headlands. Definitely come to this side of St. Martin's. an idea about how big St. Martin is. I am on the middle of the island and that direction, actually no, that direction just there faces the east and let me turn around and that's the other side of the island where you can see that's St. Mary's over there. So it's not too big but there's so much to see and explore especially just around the corner. Stay here on St. Martin's and I have come down to the beach. Look how white this sand is. This is insane and the water is so blue. I know I keep saying that in every video, but just this is England. <laughs> and I have been here many, many times before, but it's like I'm obsessed. But I am, as you can see all the way along the beach, there's like rows and rows of shells. So one of the common things to do on St. Martin's is look for cowrie shells. And yeah, I'm going to beach comb this beach and see how many carry shells I can find. 